We are starting off the day in Southern Utah. We kind of messed up because we are filming this clip after our baby shower is over. We kind of got no footage. We got a little bit of montage footage. I'll put what we have right now. I thought we would vlog more, but it was honestly just so crazy. It went by so fast, and even yeah. when we were setting up, it was just insane. So, yes, we did have a baby shower. We had it down in Southern Utah, just because this is where like pretty much all of our friends are and our family. So, we came down yesterday. I needed Parker here to do like pictures and filming and stuff, so I was like, we might as well just do co-ed, and by all your friends, that are my friends too. I'm yeah, glad that we so did we, that. Yeah, I like that. It was fun. It was more about celebrating like both of us rather than like yeah. just a. Yeah, it was and more it was, like an open house where people just came in. Yeah, we didn't do like know. opening presents yeah, and games, games and stuff. And stuff so. But I feel like it was perfect. I was worried no, it would be it. like too boring, but no, it was fun. It was really well. Everybody came and hung out. Now, so. we're just waiting for the, uh, mm. we rented some couches and we're waiting for these people yeah. to show up. We're kind of film setting up. I don't yeah. know. I wanted to like start this vlog before and film setting up and everything. We like filmed it, but it was just a really, 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 really crazy morning. So we're, it was really fun. Yeah, yeah, it was really fun. But what I was saying is we're waiting and then we're going to go get lunch at one of our favorite food places that I'm we getting, don't have up north. I'm getting the Alfredo. Really? I so never. Get two things of it? Yeah. Do you want right. the pesto? Oh, yeah. Maybe I'll get pesto. Get I never get it because it's not that healthy. I usually get a quinoa bowl, but now I don't get to eat it ever, so splurging. I have to get my own. Yeah, I'm splurging. Did you. I guess you don't need a different outfit, huh? I prepared and I brought a different outfit. I don't want to wear this to go eat lunch. Why? All I'm right. so tired. Well, me too. I didn't sleep good at all last night. Luma was. Yeah, she is not good when we take her to other people's houses. I think we need to try putting her in the office again tonight. She usually sleeps in her kennel, but at other people's houses, we just have her kennel in our room, which usually it's in a different room in our house. And then she knows we're there and just wants to snuggle us. And so she does not stay but in there. she's super indecisive. She'll, so she'll jump on and snuggle us. And then 30 seconds later, jump off the bed. Yeah. And then jump back up 30 seconds later. Yeah. And like, she just makes so much noise and she doesn't sit and stay put. Yeah. And then she was up at the crack of dawn, like wanting to party. I was like... And then last no. night I was trying to teach her how to stay in her bed. Yeah. So I put her in her bed it and I say stay. For a little. And it worked, yeah. And I noticed I would doze off and every time I dozed <laughs> off, I would fall asleep and all of a sudden wake up to you being like, What the heck? And she was like right next to <laughs> yeah, us. Yeah, she's like and she usually she's like so cuddly, but when she's tired and like trying to go to bed, she doesn't want to cuddle, she like will go usually we'll have her just like cuddling with us like in our bed for like a half hour or whatever before we're going to sleep but she's always at the end of the bed because she just doesn't want to like be cuddled but last night she was literally i would wake up and she'd be in between us yeah. <laughs> i was like get yeah. away i just want to enjoy my peaceful nights before we have a baby <laughs> so anyways today was really it was a really good success. day yeah so now we're gonna go get some food yeah oh oh yeah we want to start doing this so next time we do it we're gonna be at lunch so now we are at lunch. Got my pasta. Parker got some pesto. So freaking good. So good. Okay guys, so we are back home now. We were actually only in Southern Utah for literally like one full day. We drove down on Friday, had a shower on Saturday, and then it came home Sunday. So we did not get a ton of footage. I wish we would have vlogged like we already just barely talked about in the last clip. But so like we said, literally just barely. But for me now, it was like two days ago. It was just so crazy. So. Now we are home. Parker is actually having a sick day today. So I just made him some lunch, got him a Gatorade. He needs to lay down today, he says. But we do have a couple things that we need to get done. I just tried to be helpful and open the presents without him because he's having a sick day. He said, baby, better not be opening the presents without me. We're gonna go through them. We didn't open them at the shower because it was like an open house style shower. We are gonna just kind of start going through, organizing. Okay, 
Okay guys, so we just opened everything. I kind of have it like organized-ish, arranged in piles. So I'll show you guys a couple of the things. So this is what my family got us. It's like a little chair where you can put the baby and you can rock them. So those will be nice for if we're like working or cooking or something like that. So we just have somewhere to like put her. We also got this. Parker wanted this. It'll be fun for if we're like out taking the baby on like a hike or something. Just a little baby carrier. I'm also really excited for this. A ton of people talk about this. So it's something that you use when you're breastfeeding. And then I also have this basket of just like a ton of useful stuff. Like this is a bottle cleaning brush and like bottle cleaning soap and stuff like that. We have wipes, diapers, little like hand sanitizers, socks, stuff like that. We have a few toys. This is one that can go on her car seat to kind of keep her entertained. We also have this mirror, which is nice so that we can like see her. And then this also will be nice. It's a little stuffed lamb that has different sounds to help the baby sleep. Now we need to take all this stuff. Oh my gosh, it's so hard to stand up. <laughs> it is so hard to stand up. That literally was like painful. We need to take this stuff upstairs, but I actually haven't opened the present from Lauren yet. If you guys remember, giving presents is like her favorite thing ever. She takes so much pride in always having like the best gifts. So I figured I would actually film opening up what she gave the baby and she has such cute wrapping. So I'm gonna set the camera up again and open that one. These little cuties are over here cuddling and taking a nap. <laughs> Okay, two things before I open these. First thing, the Nordstrom anniversary sale is going on right now. I did a blog post sharing what I got and just some other things that were kind of on my wish list. So I'm gonna have that link down below if you guys wanna check it out. I think the sale ends on the second. So definitely check that out if you guys want to shop. It's literally like their hugest, biggest sale of the year and tons of stuff's on sale. So I showed what I got on my blog and I got this comfy set, which I'm obsessed with. Or you guys can also go on my Instagram and I have a highlight that's like end sale and you guys can just do like a swipe up on the different things I got. What was the second thing I was gonna say oh i was gonna tell you guys i went to the chiropractor but i had asked about it i think it was last week and i asked on instagram a few weeks ago and it actually did help but it literally only took away the pain for like 24 hours and they recommended that i go twice a week so i think i'm gonna try and do that until i have the baby they like suckered me into a membership because it was either four visits and then i got four free visits for like 98 dollars, or every individual visit was 40 so it was like kind of worth it and then i'll just cancel after i'm done obviously they like tell you to like keep on going but it did help and i couldn't figure out i was like okay is the pain actually gone or is it like in my head either way it's fine if i like feel better i don't even care if it's just like a placebo effect that like didn't actually help me but i like think that it helped me you know and then it was literally like 24 hours later the pain just like came back and i was like oh okay so that did help the pain was gone and now it's back i think i'm gonna go again tomorrow i'm gonna go twice a week i have like eight visits already paid for and hopefully maybe as i keep going it will like last longer <laughs> like the relief i don't know so we'll see i'll probably go tomorrow maybe i'll vlog that this week but anyways this is the present lauren got for the baby it's wrapped up so cute wait i actually should have got scissors oh well oh <gasps> i think this is like all the stuff that lauren has been gathering <laughs> for the baby look oh my gosh so cute i know she bought this a while ago also this this is from wild wawa which is like my favorite we also have cute little newborn onesie which is perfect because you guys know i don't have that many newborn things literally half the comments every time i talk about it are like oh my gosh my baby was a newborn for like six months and then the other half are like yeah you'll never use newborn ever so We'll just see. I have definitely plenty of stuff that I'm like not worried. Here's another cute little outfit. I think this one is from Zara. Oh wait, that's backwards. Just kidding. This is three to six months. That's perfect. I don't have tons of three to six. And look at this cute little unicorn swimsuit. Six to 12 months. Okay, perfect for next spring. I'm too lazy to go and get scissors. Cute little baby outfit. Oh. And it looks like most of these are bigger sizes, which is perfect. Oh yeah, like three to six, six to nine. This one is one of my favorites. I actually saw this the other day at H&M and I wanted to get it, but I was like, I think Lauren got that for the baby a while ago. I couldn't remember, but how cute. Me and Lauren are obsessed with like any baby clothes with faces on them or like little hats with ears on them. I think also this one is maybe from, it says made in Bangladesh, but I think she got this one maybe in Portugal. Also cute little leggings. Oh, and look at this one. Literally anything with a face on it we think is like the cutest thing ever. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think this is 
the same shirt as the pink one. I remember her texting me when she was on her trip. She was like, I can't decide which color. So she has this cutest little blue one. And then this is also a cute little jumpsuit. Oh my gosh, I can't believe there's gonna be a real baby in here. Last box. <laughs> so cute! Oh my gosh, I love it. Cute little bear suit. This is also nice too, because it looks like it's a little bit bigger. So this will be perfect for winter. Again, anything with the ears on it. Me and Lauren literally want to buy everything with ears. Oh wait, yeah, this one's made in Morocco. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So cute. Cute little baby top. And then it also has matching baby pants. That's so fun. She has so many outfits from like different countries and stuff. Okay. So that is everything I'm gonna show you guys. Also, if you're wondering what all this crap is on our bed, we have cleaning people that come every two weeks. It is literally the best, most helpful thing ever. They'd like deep clean everything and they were supposed to come this morning, but <laughs> they were late. So I texted the girl, I was like, oh, are you guys on your way? And she was like, oh, like, let me call the girls. I don't know where they are. And so then she like texted me right back. She's like, oh no, like I think her sister works for her. She's like, oh no, my sister is like in this other town with a flat tire. Like, could they come later or could they like come tomorrow? She sends me the picture of the flat tire. You can save pictures people send you, you know, and then it, in your camera roll, it will tell you like the date. So I saved it. Cause I was like, hmm, I wonder if this was just barely taken or if it's old. So I saved the picture and it was taken a week ago at like 4 p.m. So yeah, they didn't come. They said they had a flat tire, but I don't think that they did. It's fine, they can come tomorrow. I'm just grateful to have the help because I literally feel like we already do so much cleaning, just like keeping the house picked up every day. So. I really enjoy having them come every two weeks and like deep clean stuff, but it was just kind of funny and I just didn't say anything <laughs> about the picture being taken a week ago because I was like, whatever, I just need my house clean. <laughs> so if you can come tomorrow, that'll be awesome. I don't know what to do now. I guess I'll go start editing the vlog. Usually Parker edits, but like I said, today is his sick day. He's taking a nap. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. We had a lot of fun in this vlog. It was so fun to get to see all of our friends and family for our baby shower. So now we can actually like wash your clothes and all that stuff. I was waiting until we like had all of them because I didn't want to do like multiple loads. So we kept getting stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye guys. Bye.